Yo, what's up guys? This is Sam One Shot over here and this is me bringing you the fifth war of Alliance Season 17. This time we are up against the top Alliance in AQ and in Alliance rating and that is NY. And this time I'm facing still my path 3 but this time I have a nice uh, Havoc over here on Psychic Thorns so I decide to take Quake like always I pop in an invulnerability boost just in case he gains too much power and strikes me but I'm boosted up really boosted up maxly boosted up so yeah should be all good and stuff so here I'm just doing my normal Quake and Shake game nothing too complicated I'm seeing the power bar I'm seeing that he's already gaining some power but he's already down to like 40 HP so no problems over there and yeah so this was a we were expecting i think uh, a really hard matchup and so when we saw NY we were like oh, that's good that's not bad and here Havoc throws his sp1 my invulnerability boost saves me but he just drops because the concussions they hit, uh, they just hit in so yeah the fight goes well i don't lose too much hp just because of suicides then I go up against Dr. Voodoo over here, all power control uh, champ, so it's flow, so yeah, and I see the logic why they've put uh, all these champs over here that you wouldn't see usually because of the global node flow. So yeah, I just heal up my Quake, I take in, I take in into her into this fight against Voodoo, should be really straightforward, nothing too complicating, just no crit damage should be of it to be struck to him and uh, yeah everything should be going well so here it's all fine um war started off pretty much intense in a way because uh, and why they were ahead in exploration and uh, they were like i think about like 40 champs or something and we were like 10 and we were both we both had given a kill each so Kind of a, a shaky like startup but yeah it all goes fine so here i'm taking in the next uh, node with heimdall over here i still um, i had got my um even nick fury into this fight into this war so i'm pretty much boosted up 30 percent 20 percent and 10 percent so i should be good for attack bonus and stuff so my vulnerability boost still lasts over here so i was free i was like let me just rush into this fight before it expires no kind of issue over there i'm happy that i managed to like you know safeguard that and take it into the three all the three fights so that kind of helps you know and yeah as i was saying they were ahead in uh, exploration and why and they had given only one death so i mean i personally thought it was going to be like a really challenging war and it was going to be like you know a good and close uh, nice war and stuff but um, probably towards the end of the video you'll see that uh, it's not like that but anyways, uh, so yeah, I'm just uh, doing my Quake game over here, and uh, it's not any, it's not a difficult mode. He's already down, as you can see, to 26 HP, 40 seconds into the matchup, and everything's going fine. He should probably drop by the next drama, and yeah, he probably is gonna drop over here or not, not really. So. Uh, yeah, NY has a stack defense, we all know that, they're the top alliance in uh, AQ and in everything, so we were expecting like tough champs and stuff, and also with the global node flow. And so here I'm down for my path for the day one, and uh, I didn't take uh, path one this time, I took path three in section two, because there was like a taskmaster on vigor node, and here I'm going to be facing Modoc, uh, as you saw in the last video. I timed out against him so I was a little bit like mm, nervous a little bit I was like you know you don't like to see the same champ in the same in the next war uh, especially after you time out and stuff so I was a little bit you know a little nervous but not too much this is a biohazard node so I don't have to hit and I don't have to like strike their block so not to get like any bleed and poison debuff over here but yeah everything's going fine modox dropping slowly and slowly and so yeah uh, at this point of the day two i woke up and i saw that uh, and why they were like 19 deaths they given over the night and we had we had died twice only so it was a bit more relaxed i guess even my alliance mates were more relaxed and chill so we were like not so nervous about this path i still boost it up and stuff because i don't want to give any deaths you know you don't want to die two wars in a row forget about two times in the same war so <laughs> yeah <laughs> and yeah modok's dropping over here i mean you know 
it's, uh, it's, uh, it's going easy to fight, no kind of this thing. I don't take too many fights in this war, to be honest. Uh, I was supposed to take one fight here with Doctor Strange, but my uh, alliance mate and YouTuber, toma Lethal Tomato, uh, he's, uh, he took it a tomato, he took it. So yeah, uh, it was a kind of a misunderstanding, but uh, no problems. He, he does it, he clears it all fine and stuff. So here I have the next fight against a Spider-Gwen and it's a straightforward fight. I mean, it's not that it's very complicating. Um, nothing too difficult for this. I was supposed to take Doctor Strange and Sabretooth on like uh, in the mini up uh, near the boss, but uh, yeah, Tomato just jumped in and <laughs> it's all good. I mean, you know, as long as the Alliance wins, I don't have any kind of problems and stuff. And so yeah, uh, we were, uh, we had by this time it, the death count for NY was rising, they were really trying and uh, dropping, so it was a pretty straightforward fight, I guess. You know, we didn't that we didn't die that much. Here I see there's a backup recovery for Spider Gwen, so her HP goes up, and I was like, oh, okay, cool. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I hope it doesn't happen like the Vigor Node for Modok. So yeah, everything is going fine over here. Um, no kind of issue. It's just a simple, quick, uh, quick gameplay. And yeah, so we this was like a you know a war we were looking forward to because NY was first and we were third and so we wanted to beat them so that we could take over them. And yeah, that's basically it. The end of my war. Oh, as I told you, we won. Uh, so we died only six times, and uh, NY died more than that, 63 times. So yeah, uh, shout out to all the MVPs as you guys can see. And uh, I hope to guys catch you guys up in the next video. Take care. Bella.